Hey guys, so, um, Miss Frosty here. I'm just gonna come back and do, I'm sorry, my desk is like super dirty if you can see any of this and like, I know there's a bunch of stuff here, but um, <clears throat> I'm just coming back to do a review video on, well, the Xbox 360 face top controller skin that I did um, an unboxing slash immediate review type thing on it previously. So, um, I'm going to start by saying I haven't actually used this. I've had it for about a month now. I got it July 17th-ish, around there, and it's the end of August, so I've had it for over a month. Um, it's good, but I don't I don't use it often. It's really dirty. So the fact that I've probably I probably use this one week, not even one week, and it's already dirty and I just kept it on not like in a dusty place cuz on my where my Xbox and TV sit, I have like a shelf and then underneath the shelf there's like a little cabinet and that's where I kept this inside so there's no way dust could have hit it it's just over using it for like three days it became like this dusty I don't know if you can see how gross it looks but I, I don't know it's like silicone so I guess you could expect that but it's just weird and the last time I filmed the video I actually here let me just do that real quick I actually um, showed you guys my controller and how it fit over the controller and it fit this on top but as I explained in my last video that Xbox 360 controllers obviously have these little holes at the bottom well the back of it and this plugs into those little holes and in case no one has a chat pad I'll show you it's really dusty so you have these little holes at the bottom of your controller, and if you have an Xbox 360, which I'm guessing you do because this is the Xbox 360 accessory and you're watching this video, but there's like little holes at the bottom of your controller, and that's actually for a chat pad or your mic or just any other accessory you can clip on. So there's like obviously a little plug on my chat pad, just like you have on your, your, um, headsets so well it fit but this didn't actually plug in because of how thick the silicone was on the arms of the controller so unfortunately if I were to rate this from 1 to 10 I like 10 being the best I would probably uh, I want to say overall I'd probably give it a 5 for the for the, the way it looks, I would give it a seven or an eight for the texture and the way it attracts dust. I'd probably give it like a three because it doesn't feel like silicone. It feels dry, I guess, drier than what silicone feels like, and obviously it collects dust very easily. So overall, I'd probably give it a five. There's probably a few other things that I could rate about it, like the fact that this doesn't fit, that's a complete zero. If you have any accessories rather than a charger, this doesn't work with it. Rather than a charger and a headset, this doesn't work with it. So that's immediately for me, I don't like it because I like my chat pad. And anyone who plays Xbox knows that chat pad is life because it's so much easier to message people and stuff. So... Yeah, I just want to come back at y'all with a brief and simple review on actually after using this. So, in case anyone's wondering, I am planning on purchasing some more um, accessories for my controller and my Xbox. So, if anyone has any ideas of what I should purchase or anything that you want a quick review on and an unboxing or immediate review, just post that, well, comment that in the comments below and subscribe and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!